Ajahao. Hello everyone, my name is Kurt. Thank you for joining me as we study and learn beautiful Chinese. The beauty of this channel is that we're all learning together. So we don't have a, we won't have phrases per se. Well, we do have phrases. Not a phrase of the video. We won't have a culture about, something about culture. Uh, so we have something here. We're going to work on these items until I get my other side of the board freed up. I'm using that for my other channel, my second channel called Kurt Plays the Sax. Check it out. There is an intro video. Um, I don't usually, that's right, I usually do plug. It's a strange word, plug. Um, I usually advertise, let's put it that way, for the other channel here because I have subscribers here and I don't have any subscribers on Kurt Plays the Sax just yet. So, the best time to to uh, advertise is on the channels, or the best channels would be the channel that people are actually watching. So, this we have we have something in common that that these groups of words. Let's put it that way. These groups of words have something in common, and I probably won't put it on my title just because I want to see if we're if we're actually watching. Not you guys. No, I mean, I mean, not me. You guys. Are you guys watching? If you guys are paying attention, tell me what these have in common. All right. So, that's a little high. Last month. Next week. So, I did uh, the underlined part. That's going to be last. In the first in the in the first phrase the second phrase the underlined part is next now if you add the, the first character if you add if you have two of them it's actually really it's it's not last month it's the month before last so two of these characters at the beginning and the and the rest of the and these other two characters so four characters all together so these three last month add the first one the month before last just like if you add this character the first one here of these four this one for week those last two characters are equal week like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, week. Not W-E-A-K. So if you add another one of these, the first character, that's going to be the week after next. So two of those. Uh, I didn't put that in there. I just figured I might as well just tell you in the video. Uh, so add another one of the first characters. And it'll make it a week before or a month before or the week after next or the month after next so and then and then I have yesterday today tomorrow the first character yesterday second character today third character tomorrow and the last character you have to put at the end you have to put after after each character so this character will go after that character to equal yesterday this character will go after it will go after this character for today so these two these two right here that means tomorrow the only difference between this year last year this year and next year is compared to uh, to yesterday, today, and tomorrow. The first character means last year. I got I have those underlined on purpose so you can see the difference between between yesterday and last year. Now the last character also you put after each of these three characters to equal last year, this year, 
and next year. Now we also have our like it's five o'clock. You know, it's twelve o'clock in the morning. Hour. And then minute and second are together on the last line. All right. Let's go over the word, the stroke order. Let's take that out. There we go. Stroke order for these characters. I just hope this marker works. I only have one close by. I don't know why. All right. So we'll do last month. Three characters. But I'm going to put both of those for the example. I'm going to do that twice. One, two, three. So if I did that again, one, two, three. So these two plus one, two, three. And then one, two, three, four. This, two of these, the month, this is month, this is month, the month before last, the month before last, but one, just, just one of them, only one, now I'll, I'll erase it, so you, now it's last month. Okay. Next is next week. I'll put two of those there again. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now, this one, two, three. Now, week, week is two characters. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. This actually means star by itself. <clears throat> and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. See it right? Nine, ten, 11, 12. So this, the one on the right of, of this character, that's month. Together it means like a period of time. So these two is the week after next. Okay, the week after next, because there's two of them now. If I take one away, that's next week. Next week. This is under, yes. We've talked about this before. This is under. So let me erase that and that just to show. This is above. This is under when it comes to direction like that. But when it comes to, um, like also off, like to get off the bus, to get on the bus. So it's like the idea is you're going up something. So also up, go up the next floor, go down the next floor. So above, below. But when it comes to time frames, like, or even, the next person, the next person in line, for example. You, you use this one. The next person. The previous person. Or um, the previous day. It's the previous month. The previous, the next week, next, last. Okay, when it comes to like next week, last week, next person, 
last person, as in the one that the previous, the pre, not the last in the line. <laughs> the person that was in front of, so yeah, like if you're numbered one, two, three, four, five, one would be the one up here. Two would be the next number. One would be the previous number. Okay, now days. This is yesterday. So it's sun, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, that's yesterday. Might be a little too, that might be a little big. Um, today, one, two, three, four. Tomorrow, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you put this character. after all of them so that indicates yesterday today tomorrow now the only difference between that and year is this top character I'm gonna erase them all because I made it I made it disproportional all right one two three four, five, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, can you see it right? Five, six, seven, eight. And now this is, so this is last year on top, this year, next year. Now let's put year there. One, two, three, four, Five, six. I'll do that again. One, two, three, four, five. It's not going to be as long. Six. One, two, three, four. That's not that long either. I did it till it was too long. Four, five, six. Okay, so last year, this year, Next year. Now, so far my marker is doing very good. All right. Now we have our two characters. One, two, three. That's small. That's what it means by itself. One, two, three. Four. There's sun on the left of this character. Five, six, seven. This is our. And of course, if you put one and the measure word, one and the measure word, this is one hour. Just like you would do that with a uh, uh, the measure words might be different for minute and uh, and uh, second compared to hour, uh, but of course, if you're not a Chinese person and you learn Chinese and you speak and there's one this one measure word here, if this is the only measure word you learn. In Chinese and you learn how to speak it Chinese people are fine with that so you could even if that's not the right measure word they understand now the writing part might be different that, that might be a little bit different all right so minute two characters one two three four five six 
seven, eight, nine. Oh, okay, that's right. I knew that something was wrong. Something was wrong. That was in the wrong character. Okay. One, two, three, four. Now this one is the separate, a separate character. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. That is minute. Two characters for minute. And second, next, or last, the last character we're doing, we'll do the second. It's one character. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is second. Second. One second, two seconds. Three seconds, four seconds, sixty seconds, sixty minutes. Anyway, sixty seconds, one minute, sixty minutes, one hour. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed it, and don't forget check out my other channel, Kurt Plays the Sax, and also subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And let's keep learning. And I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will, like I said. Put down in the comments in this video what what do these words have in common with each other I think I'll just keep doing that um, I'll write stuff down they will have some kind of they'll, they'll be related to each other somehow word association let's put it that way right um, I think we'll keep doing that as long as we have this side of the board that I have line that I put lines on and we'll do that we'll keep it we'll keep it that way okay guys see you later Sai Chien